Okay, this is something I just learned. If you want to move around in your space, push your right con controller joystick forward and there'll be these little white dots. So what you do is you click on it, you click your controller and let go and it will move you to that spot. And I've drawn a guardian in as much of my house as I can. And so I can just walk around and get to different areas of this. And then if I swap to another area, it changes and I can actually walk around even more. And so like here, I'm walking in different parts of my house because I drew my guardian to be different parts of the house. And so I could actually walk out here and you can see back in, of course you can see my guardian too, but uh, there's no way around that because my house is rather cluttered. And so this is the only way. And when you're then you see here I'm pushing my joystick forward, going over one of those dots, pulling my trigger and letting go of the joystick. And that moves me in. And so here I can get to different parts because my guardian has moved according to where I selected for it to go. And so I can get further and further. And so I'll just follow my guardian, even though I'm walking through furniture and stuff. But as you can see, you can get to a lot of different parts. And unfortunately, when, when, you're, when you're pushing on your right joystick and you've got a red line, that's not gonna let you move anywhere. And so you have to go to one of those little white dots, push the trigger and let go and that will move you there right away. And it looks like we can see a little bit more of that side area. And so we'll move along here to where we can come over to here and then we can look more here. My cat is around somewhere, I can hear him meowing. And then say we move over to there so I'll pull my trigger and let go and I I don't know if there is a better way to control there was one time when I was actually able to go out a back door somewhere and look back into it but let's go over on this side we can get kind of close over here and then we can take a better look over here. Yeah, it was that door over there that I went through. And, or maybe it was a door over on this other side. Let's try going to this circle. Ah, this one will get us a little bit further. So let's follow my guardian over to here through the plants. And we can actually go up into here. And so you can see here, we've been able to travel all the way over to here to see what's over here. And if I pull on my joystick, and let's maybe go to that one right there and I'll let go of the joystick. And let's maybe go to this one and see where that gets me. So I just look at my guardian to see if there are any other places that these are gonna let me go to. When I look at my guardian, I just wish they had more spots that you could go to so that you could actually see where you were going. That's my sofa and that's my desk.
desk, although when you're moving around like this, your sofa position and your desk position is not correct anymore. Let's try this one and let go. Well, actually, let's try that one, let go. And let's walk all the way over to the end here. We can look out, look in the back. Yeah, see, I wish you could go in these places, but you can't. And so let's try going there. Because they're just, ah, let's, let's try this one over here. I will follow my guardian. We'll go through this furniture here, following my guardian over to here. We'll go through this wall and you can, yeah, I wish we could go in here, but you have to, you know, select different areas before it will let you move anywhere. And so let's say, let's select that one. Ooh, this one can get me way over here. Let's take a look over here. This is pretty neat, huh? And we're gonna have to go through this table and go through here. And unfortunately, it doesn't get us all the way to the wall. But you can see what's back here. Looks like a little kitchen area over there. And let's go to that one. And let's go to that one. I really want to try and get us repositioned so that we can go through, let's go through to that one. And to bring up these dots, I'm just pushing my right joystick controller forward and seeing how it repositions my guardian. Let's go to this one. Because there was one point when I went out one of those little side doors and ended up behind where I was between the back part of this station, but now I can't seem to get there. Because I'm limited to being able to walk where my guardian is. So when I select any one of those steps, it repositions my guardian. But let's see what happens. You push both the little menu buttons and it will reposition this. I don't know if that makes a difference. I need to get a better, a better handle on all this. Let's see if we walk over here. Yeah, now this isn't working. Let's try repositioning again. Okay, so I just pushed both the little menu buttons on both controllers again. And let's go here. And that didn't do anything. So let's see, we'll try going to this one. And this one. And this one, and this one, just go to the different, yeah, I wish they would have a better way of being able to control this. Nice little sleeping area it looks like here. Ooh, let's see. 
Let's follow our guardian over to here. Oop, looks like we can go out this way, not quite through the door, but through the wall. And so here we are outside. So this is about as good as I'm gonna get it. Because of course, can't go any further than this. But you can kind of see outside the space station here and get a better look. And yeah, unfortunately you can't go there. So, and Yeah, from where I'm at, I can't get to any spots, so let's go back in. So we're back in the space station now, so now I can push my trigger and let go of my joystick. And so that's basically how you, how you can move around in the virtual world here. Yeah.